Hello and welcome to my channel. Merry Christmas everybody. So today I actually sat down, brought everything downstairs to start doing my Christmas wrapping. Wrapping, I'm just going to put it in bags. I'll wrap some of it. But yeah, so and I thought just before I start doing the wrapping, I'll do a Christmas haul. So just um, go through a few of the things that I've been buying through Christmas. So to start off my Christmas wrapping, um, uh, I've poured myself a glass of my favourite champagne, which is Laurent Perrier Rosé, my absolute favourite. So yeah, it's feeling a lot like Christmas. Cheers. Mmm, lovely jubbly. I've also got my mum here with me as well. The two dogs are here, so uh, we'll see what happens. Husband is in the kitchen uh, cooking. And uh, yeah, so uh, let's get started. So I like to have a theme every Christmas. So, uh, for example, one year I bought everybody silly onesies. <laughs> Uh, another year I got um, silly hats, Christmas hats, uh, that sort of thing. So I like to have a theme and I get everybody the same thing. So this year I decided it was going to be tartan and it was going to be tartan pyjamas. So here are the tartan pyjamas for everybody and uh, even my grandson gets in on the act with his tartan pyjamas. So that's the first thing I got. Um, of course, another thing is bath bombs. I buy a lot of these as well. So bath bombs from Lush. These are the ones from Lush, but I don't only get them from Lush, but these particular ones are from Lush and they're good to add on to different presents. Can't go wrong with um, slipper socks and festive socks. So I get quite a few of them and I like to add them in with presents too. So, yep, got a few of them. In fact, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll show you what I have on as well today because I have on my festive leggings. Here we go. So, yeah, nice pair of festive leggings <laughs> from Primark. My mum's joining in as well. It's been a while. It's been a while, but yeah. So, for stocking fillers, there's some more bath bombs. Just adding them. So, I'll probably open them up and just put them, throw them into different presents. Can't go wrong with Prosecco. Give them out as well. And again, lots of sweeties. So here we have Harry Bows. And again, this is the type of thing I'll open up and throw into presents as an added thing. Boxes of chocolate. Um, so again, more stocking fillers, just little packages like that of nail varnishes and things like that. I just like to throw in kind of festive lip glosses. So these things are there are next to nothing from Primark. Uh, the other thing I like to do is just get these plastic uh, boxes and then you just fill them up with some home baking. And these are little Greek biscuits that we give out at weddings, um, have them at Christmas time, and they are called Kurabiedes. So, yep, so that's just a thing I like to kind of add in as well. Mother this year will be getting a new baby because she loves to hold her babies. And uh, this one, here she is. I haven't named her yet, but uh, this one likes to join in on the act as well. Is she going to do anything for us? Are you going to say anything? So yeah, that's... Uh, she's, 
She's looking at the baby just now, yeah. So that's, I brought my mum a new baby. But we're going to have a real life baby in the new year because my daughter-in-law is expecting. Hey! So she's expecting in May. And we're going to have <coughs> our first little female. Yes, because she's expecting a little girl. So that's my daughter-in-law that uh, got married in May. Yep, so that's their first baby. So another grandchild, yes. So, right, back, going off track again. And of course, another thing that um, is very popular at Christmas time is gift sets from the White Company. I've, there's no point me opening this up because the box is all boxed up, but it's your usual shower gel, candle, that kind of thing, moisturiser. So yeah, White Co the White, White Company is another popular place I like to shop from at Christmas time. For myself, I got a woolly hat. So yep, got me a woolly hat for Christmas. That's mine. Of course, it goes without saying that we need a couple of these boxes under the tree. Again, I'm not going to open them, but these are um, small leather goods from Louis Vuitton. And actually, one of them is canvas and the other is um, it's actually leather. I did open it up just because I wanted to check them over and make sure they were okay. And it's the first time I've ever purchased anything that's the actual leather from Louis Vuitton and it was it's absolutely beautiful lovely it really is so and um, that's the first time I'm seeing the new packaging yeah that's the new packaging from Louis Vuitton so it's kind of a, an orange box opposed to the dark brown and then it's a ribbon as opposed to the cord that we used to get before so yeah Louis Vuitton what else Burberry few things from Burberry. This is just a plain white shirt from Burberry. But what I do like about the, these shirts is if you leave the top button open, you can see the Burberry check um, on the inside there. And it's the same on the cuffs as well. So they've got the check inside the cuffs just there. So yeah, Burberry was a popular place as well and um, then it's kind of the usual just novelty things like uh, where's Wally which I'm sure we're all gonna have fun that's for my uh, grandson my boys used to love the where's Wally books they absolutely love them so I'm hoping my grandson is gonna enjoy them just as much so that's his first where's Wally book and just the usual, you know, Spider-Man and his Christmas jumper, which Yaya gets him every year. Let's just see the whole thing. This was the Netta Porter box that I showed in my last video with the brushes. So I think they're a great thing to buy somebody for, for Christmas. So that's the kind of thing you, you love to receive and don't really want to spend buying for yourself so yeah these artiste brushes are a great idea for Christmas presents what else do we have here eh, just nail varnishes and what's in that bag that small rubbery shirts and of course jumpers from Zara are a great thing that I like to get there we go this is another gift so that's got the frill just there and that's in a kind of beigey colour, font colour and got that one in grey as well. These are gifts, they're not for me. And what else? I think my mouth's drying up and uh, need a little sip of champagne. And of course, you need a train set for Christmas too. That should be great fun. So yeah, let's go. And I bought, I got these as well for 
Christmas morning for my grandson so when Santa arrives you know it's all nice and colourful so you just put them into your normal light bulbs and uh, you get the disco lights so got them bought myself my refills for my, agen for my agenda and I decided to go with the Filofax ones this year which cost just under £7 if I remember correctly um, as opposed to over £40 for the Louis Vuitton one so I just picked them up for the new year and if you're looking for them it's the pocket size ones for the small agenda the games that I got this year we got Hungry Hippos should be great fun to play boys love that I've actually got a lot of the games um, from the boys when they were young but that was one of the games that broke down so I've got um, Pie Face can't wait to play that get some cream for that as well so this is the game where you turn the dial and you don't know when the thing's going to come and splatter you on your face so that should be a good family game to play and uh, say it don't spray it really looking forward to that we actually play a game quite similar to this where you um, say vegetables without showing your teeth and it's really quite hilarious especially after a couple of glasses of wine so uh, looking forward to playing this in fact I'll have a wee go at it so I'll put the guard thing in and say something and then you can all write down in the comments down below what you think it is. So this should be interesting. This is what happens when you have kind of a few sips of champagne. You start doing silly things. So the gut, these mouthpieces come in different sizes. Here we go. So you've got the blue one, the yellow one, and the red one. They're all different sizes. So that looks small. So I'm guessing I don't have a really small mouth. Um, that's for a big mouth. I would say I don't have a big mouth, although a lot of people would disagree. So that's the middle size one. So uh, what you do, you put it in. Can't believe I'm doing this. Let's get the cards. So I'll look at the cards and right. So you get these cards here and they have a phrase on them and you kind of try and say that with this in your mouth. So uh, <laughs> here goes. Smear the lipstick. I think I'm going to say before I do this, I'm going to say bye because i'm not going to take it because it's going to be stick all over my face so i'm going to say just now i wish you all a very merry christmas a uh, happy new year i probably won't be um, <laughs> uploading again until the new year because my uh, son daughter and my beautiful grandson are coming over so uh, it's time to spend with the family so um yeah I'm wishing you all a Merry Christmas, a very Happy New Year. May all your wishes um, come true in the new year. And uh, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And it's amazing when you see just another subscriber and the likes, of course. So thank you very much and uh, I'll see you next time. Well, I can't work this out, mate. Ah, 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 how is that? Uh huh. Uh huh. Huh. Yeah, yeah, hey, come.